Two teams ready, they hope, to clear the final hurdle, the final Europa League hurdle. And the atmosphere is building up already. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Well, the anticipation is over, and now the big day is here. It's the final of the UEFA Europa League. I'm Derek Ray, and as always on these big occasions, I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. We're on the cusp of kickoff. It's Hoffenheim facing Molde. Well, the long road from the start of the competition almost a year ago to the final is here. Both teams at the added advantage of if they win this competition, a Champions League place is available. A look at the initial 11 for Hoffenheim. The wing backs are going to be crucial in this setup. You've played in that position, Lee. Yeah, I didn't really like it. And we always thought when we were playing against five at the back with the wing backs exposed like this in this formation, that a 4 4 2 can really create a 2 v 1 down the side. So keep your eye out for that. And the three narrow midfield players supply the support for the two forwards up front. This is what they'll be up against today. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Samaseku. Bebu with it. Baumgartner. Diadi Samaseku and Kramaric on the ball great challenge he got nothing but ball well every football coach likes to have a versatile forward in his ranks Andre Kramaric is certainly one such player Lee what do you think we might see from him today well his ability on the ball is second to none just watch how close he keeps the ball to his feet he lures defenders in then quick turn of pace and he's away from you. Brilliant player. Hussein. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. He just needs to stay level-headed there. Just couldn't get it through. Corner kick played in. The keeper was up to the task. Well, it's a decent effort, but it's a real opportunity goes begging there. Mijat Gacinovic. Sebastian Rudi. has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Aursnes. Frederik Aursnes. Hussein. 
It's with Akram. It might be on for them. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Dangerous looking attack. It's with Akram. Well, possibilities in the center. I will they be able to play it in behind the defense? Excellent defending. Miat Gacinovic. Well, attacking possibilities. Excellent challenge. The possession lost, intercepted. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Stefan Posch setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. So tight this game. Who's going to break the deadlock? Be brave, be a hero, take chances. Jörn Sigurdarsson. Fredrik Aursnes. He's got space. A terrific pass. Now he's got to stay calm. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. The high press was very much on. Frederik Aursnes. Hussein. And the intervention, a good one by Rudi. And that is that for the first half of this UEFA Europa League final. I think, Lee, we're entitled to expect more appetising fare in the second half. Well, we're entitled to our money back. That's been absolutely horrible. Really not enjoyed that at all. Let's hope the second half provides a little bit... The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. Take it away. Bebu. Sebastian Rudi. On to Samaseku. No high quality defending. Hussein. Can they make one of these passes count? Space and time for the cross. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Can he get them in front? Wide of the target, and he's going to be disappointed. Disappointed? Wow, it's a shocker. He should be doing a lot, lot better than that. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Stefan Posch. Posch. Baumgartner. Miat Gacinovic. Stefan Posch. Sebastian Rudi. Gacinovic with it. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Lorian Grilic. And it might be. There it is! How about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild.
Well, we see it again here, and the pace and accuracy of this passing is a dream. And then the sheer power of the strike, really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. One nil then. Matis Bolli. Hussein. Magnus Wolf Eikram. Oh, potential danger. It's with Eikram. Oh, nice ball over the top. Heystad. Happy to take on the shot. And able to get a body in the way. Bebou. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Do they have the guile to open up the defence? Florian Grilic making excellent progress with the ball at his feet determined defending Heystad only 10 minutes remaining here really effective shielding under pressure Hussein are certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Magnus Wolf Eikram. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Can they get in behind them? He must finish! What a vital intervention. Intense pressure. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Now he must favour the cross. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. And my goodness, Lee.